Welcome to the Bentec 7X Large Radius Module Tutorial. Start by opening the Bentec software to the Task Menu screen and select the Sketch 2D icon from the list. Maximize the screen and select the Material and Die from the drop down menus to the left. Now, change the grid spacing to 6 as seen here. The grid in the display area will now show 6 inch intervals. Start the project by simply selecting the origin here and draw upwards 18 inches, then click to place a point. Then go right 12 inches and up 6, then click to place another point. Now go right 12 inches and down 6 to place another point. And go straight down 18 inches and click to finish the outline of the part. Click the green finish button to the left to solidify the numbers that make up our part. Once you've done this, the task tab will give you options for altering the part. But first, we'll need to change the radius of our second bend. So go up to the transfer button and select the new assembly from the list. The prepare for assembly window will appear. To position the part for transferring, first select the rotate button once to stand the part up. Then select the axis button, choose the red axis, and click the rotate button three times. Select the OK button to send the part to the assembly. When the window appears asking if you wish to add the part directly into the design, select the Yes button. The part will be set to the TriStar. Now select the Edit button and click the Adjust Radius button below. Then click and hold the top bend of our part and drag it downward to increase the radius. Now select the Nudge Bend button followed by the Large Radius Bend and click the green F until you can't nudge it any further. Then you can decrease the radius which will allow you to nudge the bend to the front even further. When you're satisfied with the location of the bend, go to the miscellaneous sub-tab and select the Bump Bending button. This feature of the large radius module is for users with rotary draw or rotary compression benders and will give the look of a roll bend by adding many smaller bends to a large radius. So select the top bend again and the Bump Bend tool window will appear. Select the appropriate die used for this process, then select the second bend then type 10 into the number of bumps and apply the bumps by clicking OK. As you can see, the profile in red shows the multiple bumps in the tubing. To get bending instructions, go to the Parts tab and select the part from the list. Then click on the Transfer button above and choose the custom part option. Here you will be able to adjust the part by entering different information into the value fields off to the left. Use the other tools in the tasks tab and view and print out the bending instructions from above. Thank you for participating in the Bentec 7X large radius module tutorial. For more helpful and informational videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel here and like us on Facebook.